Yes, my peoples, it's T. And I'm Sadia, and in this video, we're going to be unboxing the Insta 361 4K Edition Action Cam and the Dual 360 mod. Let's get it. All right, so let's proceed with the unboxing. So we're going to start with this first <laughs> the Insta 361R. I'll let you do the honors. Lovely. I don't know if it's got the. Uh, there's no tabs on it. There's no tabs like Apple do it, unfortunately. So. I'll try and use my nails. No, I can't do it. <laughs> I'll try and use my nails. <laughs> my lack of nails. With a bit of force, a bit of strength. I don't know why they haven't added a tab. Like everyone should do it the way Apple does it. I'm trying to say cost there, but there we go. Plastic is being unraveled. Cardboard box. <laughs> Lovely. So this is the box and at the back it kind of demonstrates uh, some of the key features on the side here as well, which we'll go through in just a second. But first, let's see what's inside. So let's open this up. I hate doing this part because it's always so difficult. We'll get there eventually. And three, two, one. Ta -da. <laughs> this is the Insta360 1R in all its glory fresh out of the box so as you can see at the top we have the actual action cam itself and as you can see well it's a bit of a modular approach here so it's nice and sleek it's quite small as well very small and then <coughs> i guess this is just what it mounts onto but we'll we'll get to the camera in a sec so let's go into the accessories it's gonna be a little box there. So, yep, little box. Let's get this open. Assistance needed. Let me <laughs> open this. So, there we go. This box is actually pretty tight. Yeah, it is. So, there we go. Proper snug fit. Box open. Let's start with that. Yep. So, inside, we've just got a USB C cable. Pretty standard stuff. Mm hmm. Then in the Let's second section of the box, we have what appears to be some sort of mounting case for the action cam. And you can see it's got the standard connectors here, which you see on all the action cams, such as the uh, GoPros, GoPros, the Acaso, which we reviewed. And the Acaso's <laughs> click here to watch that video. Um, and also, as you can see, um, it has the play button well, sorry, the record button on the top as well. So that kind of attaches to the Insta360. So yeah, nice little case there. Yep. Also, as well as inside of that case was the rest, the remaining connectors required to attach to that. Lovely. These two here. You can do the remainder of the box. Oops. Oops. <laughs> and then you've got, let's see. So there's a couple of things in there. There's an Insta360 sticker, which I'm not sure where you'd even put that, but does anyone really use the stickers? So let's just throw that away. <laughs> Silica gel, throw away, do not eat, obviously. <laughs> um, and we've got a couple of booklets here, which I assume just, yep, yeah, quick start guide. Um, uh, one about waterproofing, which is one of the key features. And then, yeah, just a warranty card. So just standard stuff again. And then in here, it looks like it's a, it looks like some sort of microfiber cleaning cloth. And yeah, it's just. You are correct. Yeah, just a cloth. Cleaning cloth. <laughs> and that's everything that comes in the Insta360 1R camera. Just for, just for one more time, I'm gonna actually take these outside of the box as well. So you can see a little up close. Just to check, box is empty, there's nothing else in there. Um, this actually could have been a smaller box, to be fair. It could have, yeah. Um, but yes, we have that one piece there, and we have the protective film on here as well, which, of course, we're going to... Actually, let's remove this now, because this is satisfying as well. Mm -hmm. I won't remove one, one on the back of the screen, because I have a, a bit of an OCD of not removing protective <laughs> films of things. don't know why. But the one on the camera needs to be removed, so let's do that together. ASMR. <laughs> let's go. yeah <laughs> oh that is satisfying <laughs> so yeah insta360 unboxed and now we're going to unbox the dual lens 360 mod let's check it out let's check it out dual lens 360 mod 
Okay, so this didn't come in a plastic film this time, but it is securely closed with a little sticker. Um, so I'll let you and your nails <laughs> unbox that. <laughs> Don't really have long nails, but five hours later. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, yep, yeah, got this open. Five hours later. Get some support there. So boom, as you can see, opens up. Nice little protective sponge here and a little leaflet. So let's see what this leaflet actually says. Um, unnecessary really, just a piece of paper which says nothing. <laughs> <laughs> and then inside we've got the dual lens, which you can see here. Lovely. And then finally we have whatever this is. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we'll find out later what this is. Don't know I, what it is. I feel like the dual lens sits in there. I think it's a protective case because you've got, That's obviously it's a dual lens, so you've got a lens on this side and this side, which we'll explain in a minute. So I think that literally just fits in there and protects the lens on both sides. Lovely. So that's the unboxing of the Insta360 dual lens mod. So later on we'll show you what both these elements do, the 360 lens and also the regular lens as well. Manscaped have partnered with Jampack and they have sent us the Performance Package 4.0, which is the latest and greatest. And I can confirm that it is a game changer. Oof, little manscaped boxes here. Nice little smooth material there for anti chafing as well. We save balls, um, save my balls, that's for sure. It'll give you little handy little tips. You know, you can shave a, a crown into your, into your crop. The Lawnmower 4.0, this trimmer is the future of grooming. And dare I say, the greatest ball trimmer ever. Maybe, maybe. The fourth generation trimmer features a cutting edge ceramic blade to reduce grooming accidents. The Lawnmower 4.0 is waterproof. It also has a 4K LED spotlight that you will need for a more precise shave, as you can see. Yeah, very nice. The Weed Whacker is also waterproof and has the same technology as the main Lawnmower 4.0. It has a proprietary skin safe technology which helps reduce nicks and snags and tugs of those delicate holds, your ears, your nose. Manscaped Crop pres Preserver. Um, this is a ball deodorant. If I, if I give it a little smell, <laughs> delightful. <laughs> Absolutely delightful. We have the Crop Reviver. Um, so as the name says, this will revive your crop. It is a ball toner and it is very refreshing. Um, also smells <laughs> delightful, delightful. And trust me guys, when I say your balls will thank you. <laughs> so go over to manscaped.com. You get 20% off plus free shipping with the code JAMPACK. Head over there, your balls will thank you later. So onto the features. So the camera has a dual lens as we showed, showed you earlier. Uh, one side is the 360 lens for the 360 camera obviously and on the other side you've got 4k which shoots at 60 frames per second and it's at a wide angle nice nice oh and what i forgot to mention is that the 360 lens actually raises the bar with a 5.7k resolution which is so sick like does any gadget even have that resolution it's pretty high yeah very high so high the quality, quality must be amazing but we'll definitely put that to the test Nice. Also to add to that, it has a flow state stabilization, which means it offers the type of stabilization that you get on a gimbal, but without the gimbal. So that's one less thing to purchase. Happy days. Yeah. And one cool feature is that it has an invisible selfie stick um, feature, which basically means you can hold your selfie stick out with the camera attached and you won't actually see the selfie stick in the camera in the shot which is really really cool the only problem is you do have to buy that separately the selfie stick that is um, but I've put it up on screen and you can see it's around 20 pounds so it's not too bad but we don't actually have it so unfortunately we can't test that out but it's really cool very cool I actually do wonder if if that feature works with normal selfie sticks probably not but I'm sure the camera has the, um, the software available to to notice what's a stick and what's not a stick and remove it out of the shot who knows yeah i mean I, i'm very intrigued as to how it works because that's really cool indeed um 
Also to add to that, as with most gadgets these days, the Insta360 ONE R is waterproof and it's a big one. It's waterproof up to five meters, which is pretty deep and you can actually get some beautiful shots on the water, for example, um, with your Insta360 ONE R action cam. And one of the other cool features is point to track. So what you could do is you can track your subject by tapping the screen or what you could do is say, do a voice command essentially so you can literally point the camera at whatever you know whatever your subject is and then just shout mark that and the camera will use that as a guide and track that subject which is so cool so you can either tap or use a voice command wow that's actually incredible yeah i'm looking forward to testing that bit out mm, technology's come a long way so yeah <laughs> and one of the last key features um is that it, it allows you to actually speed up your footage using the stabilized hyperlapse feature so you can take it slow and you can speed up <laughs> or you can do also a cinematic slow-mo also as well so lots of cool features attached to this camera and it is jam-packed full of amazing incredible quality another thing i wanted to also talk about is recently insta360 have released the, an r an s version of this model um and you're probably thinking should I buy this version or should I buy the RS version? Of course, the RS version, I know it costs around £500 um, and the R version will now be a lot cheaper based on the new model being released. And in my personal opinion, there's not really a large, huge amount of difference in the features available in the, in the two devices. So if you're, if, if you're not looking for any specific RS version features, I'll happily go with the Insta360 R version save a bit of money but still have the jam-packed quality cool and before we wrap up this unboxing here's some demo shots from the insta360 camera so what do jam pack think about the insta360 R oh. action camera well in my opinion these 4k shots are looking absolutely beautiful um, it's one of the it's one of the highest quality action cams I've actually seen um, and I've seen, of course, the Caxel, um, and, and I've also seen a couple of the the main brand one as well, which I won't mention. Um, <laughs> but this one, high quality, beautiful shots, and a few of the features with the 360 um, view of 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 your know, your surroundings, I find it actually incredible. It's really cool. Yeah. So, like, it's really impressive, and the quality the quality of the 360 lens is. Yeah, phenomenal. Very good, very good. So, in my opinion, I give that a jam pack rating of four out of five, and it's a recommend from me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>